Welcome back to Three Hopes. Today, we'll be going through the paralogue quest for this chapter. It stars Dimitri, Sylvain, and Rodrigue. Three lance wielders. So let's go ahead and get into um, this. Raiders from the North. Perhaps hoping to take advantage of the trouble brewing within the kingdom, the people of Shrang launch an invasion from the north. Dimitri rides out with his best soldiers to intercept. Oh, I'll get for all Darius soldiers if I S rank this, which I doubt. And I got get Gautier Knights for beating this one. So let's go ahead and start this up, shall we? Ugh. There may not be snow here, but the wind still settles right in your bones. Yes, it's often coldest in places without snow. Uh, apologies for dragging you so far north, and then saddling you with reconnaissance duties. Still, how are things looking? Thought for sure we'd see signs of the enemy by now, but I've got nothing. You really think those Srang folks are coming over these mountains? Seems like a pretty risky plan. Oh, they will come. It's in their nature. And if I know their leader, this will be a much larger raid than normal. Uh, ask about our leader. This leader sounds like a big deal. Yes, he's quite well versed in Fodland's culture and military strategy alike. After he was surrendered to Margrave Gautier as a prisoner of war, he was held here for some time. The Margrave lost his wife to the Srang offensive, and I know he harbored many ill feelings towards their people. But he also hoped to improve relations between the two peoples, and thusly treated his prisoner well teaching him our language and customs. Sadly, the prisoner did not appreciate the effort. He fled Margrave Gautier at his first opportunity and scurried back home. But if Srang offered him as a hostage, why would they welcome him back? It's all a bit muddled and unclear. Father dispatched men to find out the truth of the matter, but everyone feigned ignorance. Still... He now leads the Srang forces, which means they must have at least some respect for the man. Doubtless, they were pleased when he walked in the door with inside knowledge of Fodlan practically oozing from his pores. You've got one interesting neighbor, I'll give you that. Things are tougher in the north than I thought. I'm glad you've come to understand our situation, at least in some small part. Our preparations are complete, Father. Perhaps it's time we gather the generals? Yes. Once everyone is here, we'll depart for the Ruska Mountains and take shelter at the stronghold in the foothills. That stronghold again? We're practically retracing the entire northern campaign at this point. Yes, that is where hostilities began, isn't it? Your Majesty, House Gautier should have been able to handle this situation ourselves. Pray forgive me for dragging you into it. Not at all. Gautier and Fraldarius have long been allies in the fight against the forces of Srang. It is only right that the leader of House Blathed should come to your aid in a time of such crisis. I'll be counting on you and Sylvain as well. Show confidence? Don't worry. We'll send these folks packing. Great. In that case, maybe I'll kick back and let you do all the... Kidding. <laughs> Kidding. Of course, I'll give this everything I have. Well, except my life. I'll be keeping that. I'll do my best as well, Margrave. Though, having ceded the Fraudarius title to my son, I fear I am not but a common military man now. False modesty ill suits you, Rodrigue. Now let's all go out there and make our king proud.
Okay, I just wanted to point something out. Um, it's like this whole time, I've been thinking that Margrave is a title, but I think that's his name. It's just such a weird name to have. Unless that is a title, but it's whatever. Drive back to Shrang army. Any allies are routed. All right, dang. It's like a whole lot to this place. I've probably been here before. I'm not... Wait. Yeah, this is... This is that same map. It's just flipped upside down. Because this is the outside, and then this is the inside. I'm talking about the map from the main quest and the... I think the side quest before that one. <coughs> Alright, so let's deal with, uh, well, I, I can't change anybody, so I have to deal with what I have here. Oh, we should be good. I mean, I'm starting with Chez, so as I start in the middle. Let's have um, Dimitri take the right side. Sylvain just get like the bottom here. Have Rodrigue take the left side. And we should all be good. I just need to check everything now. It's like a bunch of assassins or whatever. I'm sure stuff will pop up. I was seeing if there's like any, um, like, armored units on their side, which it doesn't look like there are. <laughs> so I guess whoever I start with, um, is like, I just immediately start the plan, just try to capture all these, basically capture the outposts and then just take out any enemies, any enemies like along the way. Because the outside will open up eventually. This is a matter of time. I don't have to do a battle plan because I pretty much just gave it to you. So let's go ahead and start this up. I did eat a meal that had uh, Sylvain and Rodrigue there. So they gained something from it and I gained some active meal effects. I forgot which ones. I think it's like the weapon durability. Is that in... It's like one of the warrior gauge ones. Let's go ahead. Brave soldiers of Vargas. We will proceed as planned. We must strive to procure you, Aladdin. I'll make short work of this. We must act now, before the worry sets in. Let us see what we can do. I task you now with this. To defeat the forces of Strang and prove your might anew. <laughs> The Shrang generals infiltrated the fortress. Defeat them. I will hold down the strong tower. You focus on dispatching the enemy. Strike with all your might. Let us crush the defenses. I'll try to get as much money as possible. Margaret should be good. Well, not sure how I feel about that one. Not a problem. I'm here to help. 
We must strive to perform to the best of us. I've awaited this moment. <laughs> Let's try to take out like all of the small enemies over here. All right, let's uh. Proceed as planned. We must strive to perform Oops. to the best of our ability. I'll make sure I'm ready to go. Hold on. We must act now. But let us see. I'll wait for that. Use the magic to the best of the build of his ability. Head and oh, hear you loud and clear. Oh, no, oh, he's fighting him, I believe. We must have All right, uh, let's go. Wait. So if there's, if there's a chance with money, I'm going to get it. So I'm over there. Switch to Rodri. the young Margrave and Lake King once again. It's quite the sensation. I'm honored you think I stack up to my father. I can't help but feel like I'm pale in comparison. Enough of that. You are more than worthy of the comparison. To one day take his place as the Margrave. And hey, Dimitri's already blazed that path, so he's gotta know what he's talking about. Okay, so Margrave isn't his name. It's, it's just a title. I feel dumb. I feel dumb when I said that other stuff earlier. I wonder what his name is, then. <laughs> Alright, so once again... Somebody just get him there. Catch them napping. So I'm gonna Not get. I'm gonna just get him over here. This. Just take out like everything before continuing. I'm probably not gonna get an S rank, but it's like it's fine. I shall take the lead. <laughs> That was quite awesome. Just allow me. Go back over. 
The gates are open. There will be no end if we stay on the defensive. <clears throat> we must act now before the worry sets in. It's Let over us there. see what we can do. We will proceed as planned. We must strive to perform to the best of our ability. Take Perhaps a breather. we should take the fight to our enemy instead. Seize the strongholds within the time limit to prevent enemy reinforcements from appearing. Okay. These wild tactics remind me of my father's chess strategies. Wait. I think they might be trying to reach our base. Uh, Alright. Not a problem. I've got this. I'll make sure. Stand back. Let us crush the defense. This stronghold will fall. <laughs> Where is we must Audrey? Do that. Let's see what we can do. I'll do something real quick. <clears throat> now, strike with all your might. Like, where is it? There it is. There we go. Hear you loud and clear. I'm gonna get him here. I'll make short work of this. And then switch to Dimitri. Proceed as planned. Get him over. My time has come. My father's first wife, the one who died in the Stranglands. What was she like? She was a classmate of ours at the Academy, and the star pupil of the Black Eagles. I understand he earned his wall of ice monitor after she was lost. Indeed. Before that, he was a lively young man, Around cheerful, me. friendly to the last. Holy oh, crud. <clears throat> Defeat the Shrang generals and defend the strongholds. <clears throat> mm, I'll be fine. Oops. Could find fault with us. There's I Dimitri. My son isn't causing you or his majesty too much trouble. <laughs> oh, hold on. Where you guys think you're going? The one who's as loud as a cannon. That must be who we're looking for. Defeat the reinforcements. Okay. Here you I'll make short work of this. We will proceed it. We must strive to perform to the best of our ability. We must act now. Let us see what we can do. <clears throat> Wait, that's it? Oh man, that's a bad level up. 
Where do you guys think you're going? Yeah, Margrave's fine. <clears throat> Get him. Oh, my crud. Definitely level up. <clears throat> I'll hesitate no longer. Could be a better level up. <clears throat> Proceed as planned. I'll have him attack them. To perform to the best of our ability. Let us see. Allow me. <laughs> <laughs> Not level up for him? <laughs> yeah. Mm, I was expecting more. Another horrible level up. <laughs> That's Sylvain? Yeah. Wish this wasn't so much effort. So it's like two people got horrible level ups and two got pretty good. Now, before the worry sets in, let us see what we can do. I'll make sure you. I'm ready to go. <laughs> he's, he's getting a lot of the warrior gauge is up. Hear you loud and clear. Let me heal him. Hear you loud and, and then get him over sure here. And switch over to... Prepared. Hear you oh, loud hold on. And clear. <laughs> uh, I, I'm, I'm gonna just switch over to... Rodrigue. My time has come. <laughs> Yeah. 
Give me this. Time to... I'm gonna just bowl over everybody. He got two level ups. I put the experience gem on him, so that's probably why. Open the gates. Don't hate us for this. Our way of life hangs in the balance. No, he ain't. That's great. <clears throat> Just did. Perhaps I thought too highly of my troops, but I can retreat with my pride intact. Yeah, and don't come back. Or if you do, at least leave your weapons and soldiers behind. <laughs> I'll think about it. You closer? Enhance. I'm surprised it got so close to him. <laughs> oh, dang, man. 15 seconds. 15 seconds. <clears throat> it's like that went better than I thought it would. I'm ever chasing Lambert's shadow. That definitely went better than I thought it would. I have some fight in me yet. He definitely needs it. He's been gone for like an entire chapter. And I don't have the money to level everybody up. <clears throat> but I leveled up a bunch of combat arts. Assassinate's done so I can give him another sword art online. <laughs> Whew. But yeah. This went just great. Silver gauntlet. No. Um, rapier. Okay. Good haul. I just wish I got an S rank on that. With how well that went, I wish I got an S rank. If I didn't, if I didn't focus on defeating every enemy, I would have gotten an S rank. Was I probably had to defeat every enemy to get the KO amount to where it needed to be? But it's like that's fine. Ugh. I just wanted that S rank though. Descended upon us like a storm. I've never seen the people of Srang fight with such ferocity, and their leader was a pure terror. Still, I thought that man more discerning than to simply attempt to batter his way into Fargus. Hmm. I just assume that someone incited them. Sounds like someone lit a fire under them. Probably convinced them this was their chance to take out the kingdom, what with our being occupied with the Empire and all. 
But who would this flame stoker be? Someone from Adrestia, perhaps. We can't discount Cornelia and her ilk. They're like a bad rash that won't go away. It will take time to pin down the truth. But even if this is the result of some outside influence on the Srang clans, the fault still lies with me. I never should have educated that man. Don't blame yourself, father. The people of Srang do not speak the language of Fodlan. Had he never learned it, Yet Sylvain was only able to get through to him as a result of your teachings. And though his words lacked compassion, it was still quite remarkable to hear him speak at all. I was raised to think of the Srang people as demons who emerged unbidden from the snowy tundra. Considering that, exchanging even a few meager sentences with them feels like a miracle. I agree with His Majesty. We will never achieve peace without understanding each other. And you know we can't end this through sheer force of arms alone, Father. We already understand our enemy perfectly well. They fight for a port that is not choked with ice and for land that is warm and fertile. Yet Fargus is hardly a region of abundance, and there is nothing we can spare them. So how exactly do you hope to achieve peace amidst such scarcity? I don't know, yet. But I'll keep searching for a way, even if it takes my entire life. Ugh. You remain as naive as ever, boy. Matthias, wait! Apologies, Your Majesty. I will go speak with him. You should make ready to head back. Heard his name before. <clears throat> so that's his name. What the Margrave says is reasonable, yet I sense an earnestness in your words as well, Sylvain. Oh, I'm earnest, all right. I'll drag our people kicking and screaming to peace if that's what I have to do. Encouraging. Peace with Srang doesn't sound like some hopeless ideal to me. I'm sure you'll find a way to pull it off. <laughs> Thanks. That means a lot. Regardless, we must eliminate this threat if we ever hope to free ourselves from the power of the relics. Still, there's no reason we must do so through military might and bloodshed, if another way will suffice. I appreciate the way you think, Sylvain. I truly do. And I'm always impressed with how much you hate warfare, considering how good you are at it. Is your father going to be okay? He didn't exactly take well to your opinion back there. Trust me, I've been a son for long enough to know that the feelings he keeps private can fill a library. If he really thought I was some kind of naive idiot, he'd have kept it to himself. There's something else weighing on his mind here. I'm certain of it. There you are, Matthias. Do you remember the night of the ball, Rodrigue? Back in our days at the Academy? You, me, and Lambert grew weary of the festivities and stole away to train by ourselves. How could I forget? The stars in that sky were a true sight to behold. We talked about all sorts of things that night. It was the first time we ever discussed our dreams for the future, and the last as well. Lambert told us how he hoped to forge a peace between Fargus and the people of Srang in Dusker. Ha! <laughs> he certainly did. And once he was named King, the man did his best to see it through. Srang may have been a lost cause, but he worked tirelessly to bring Dusker into the fold. I called him naive that night. His dream sounded like the thing of childhood storybooks and cradle tales. But these days I wonder if I wasn't the naive one. He always took the long view of things, 
saw the whole continent unfolding before him. But me? I've lost too many over the years, and their blood clouds my vision. I could never see things now as he once did. Could there really be a pathway to peace? Ah. You haven't changed one bit, Matthias. If you regret what you said to Sylvain, I suggest you find him and apologize before this goes any further. Yes. Yes, you're right. Ooh, the Lance of Ruin. <clears throat> Sylvain's weapon! Amazing. Alright, so I can't really do too much with that at the moment because I'm still broke. I'm still in like the phase of being broke. <clears throat> but is I still need materials and stuff for that as well. So I think for like for the most part, if I'm able to get enough money, is I'll try to get either maybe one or two sacred weapons or heroes relics like completely forged and on their owners so they can like actually have their weapons <clears throat> so they'll free up some other weapons and like upgrade those and whatnot um i'm gonna go ahead and do this extra quest Let's begin. It's time to move. All right, here I go. There's nothing these muscles can't do. Shall we? Let's give it a shot. Not a problem. I've got this. Yeah, you can count on me and my muscles. I've got to take a breather. Yep. You'll make this fun for me. Goodness. Raph is fine. Yeah, not bad. Sure, not bad. I can still fight. Of course you can. Not a problem. 
get him right here. Shall we? Let's give it a shot. It's time. I'm good. Thanks. Oh. Okay. Not a problem. I've got this. I'm going. I've seen hers yet. Goodness. I'll get this down and then switch over to Wrath. Which is there it is. You got it. Myself stop here. Level up of even more. All right. Oh, is Jewel Devastator already level three? I didn't look at uh, his combat arts when I went into there. I checked Chez's, but not Raf's. And it's like, I'm, I'm not going to do anything to these. These are all useless to me. Hmm. 
I need more Agarthy, I mean. The other thing I'm gonna steal. Stuff in general. Alrighty. Okay, next time we will be going to this side quest. And like if I'm I'm sure there's gonna be one right here. So we'll be doing like those side quests and then I'll be bulking up. After that I'll be bulking up for the support conversations and then the main quest. So until next time, I'll be seeing ya.